All right, guys, uh, not sure if you watched my previous mail day video, but uh, these packs are packs that I won in whatnot streams. I did not buy them. They were additional winnings that I had in uh, whatnot streams. So I decided I'm going to just open these guys up on video for you guys to see. Um, after some further research, it looks like Without being able to prove these came from an unsearched case uh, with certification showing that these things sell for like 10 to 15 bucks a piece max. And the value of them in the condition I have them, knowing that they're from unsearched cases, is more like 50 plus per pack. So since there's absolutely no chance for me to get that value by selling them, I decided, what the heck, let's open them up. Let's have some fun. I do know about five of the packs from the box this came out of have been opened. And for sure, the big one, the Phil Sims one, and I believe the Walter Payton one were not hit in any of those packs. So just knowing that those weren't hit, and I've got five packs... I don't know how many are in a box, but I'm pretty sure it's like somewhere around 12. If you know, let me know, but I'm just guessing. But I've got a, a large percentage of the, the packs that are in that box. And I know the Sims and Peyton haven't been hit yet. So let's open these up. Let's have some fun. We'll see. Will I regret it? Probably not. It's fun opening packs. And you know what? You don't get to open vintage packs very often. So let's do this. Pack number one. Uh, I don't think I've ever opened up a pack like this before. Alright. What do we got here? I think I've only ever used this opened up cello packs that you like rip open. Alright. We've got some nasty gum in there. I'm not going to eat that. We've got Gerald Irons, Stan Walters. Oh, I'm not showing you the cards very well, am I? Gerald Irons, Stan Walters. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. We got the Phil Sims. We got the Phil Sims. The centering is not uh, PSA 10 worthy, but... We got the we got the Sims. Oh my goodness, boys. We got the Sims. Holy cow. All right. All right. Whoo, that's a big boy. Okay. Where uh where did I put my sleeves? I can't find my sleeves. Whew. Breathe, Michael. Breathe. I found them. Oh my goodness. We got the Sims. Holy smokes, boys. We got it. The very first pack we hit it. Oh my goodness, I didn't even have my sleeves ready to go. Here's a trick if you guys don't know uh, to protect corners. Just stick your finger in here and bust it open. Then you got this little uh, flap right here on the side. I don't know how well you can see it, but then when you put the card in, you just kind of stick it in and push it in from the side and then down. That protects it the most that you can. Holy God, holy cow, guys, we got a Phil Sims. You know what? I'm just going to put a flag on it right away to make it easier to pull out in the future because I don't want to risk damaging this card. This is a this is a minty card, boys. There's like no damage, period, obviously. Pack fresh. Um, whew, we got it. We got it. We're probably going to just sell it raw because it's not going to 10. We'll probably put that on eBay, but we'll see. We'll see. Whoo, that was awesome. All right, well, now we got to finish. Jim LeClaire, Craig Colquitt, John Fitzgerald, Jesse Baker. All right, we got to flip over here. I don't know, Bob Kazeel. Mel Gray, Checklist, 
Harold Carmichael. And Cowboys team leaders. I can't believe that, boys. We got the Phil Sims rookie card in the first pack. I'll tell you what, guys. I'll tell you what. I'm going to hold on to these packs of gum. These gum from these packs. And when we get to... Uh, whew, I don't know. Let me think about it. I might I might come up with an idea to 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 stick one of those in my mouth and chew it up. We'll see. Oh my goodness. Okay. Phil Sims. I can't believe it. I wish the centering were better. Where's the gum? Oh, it's stuck to the back of the card. Stuck to the back of the card. Thank goodness that's not the Phil Sims. All right. Lynn Kane. Richard Todd, Noah Jackson, Dan Deerdorf, Dexter Busey, Tony Dorsett, Chris Barr, Leonard Thompson, Tom Rafferty, Mike Washington, Hey, I'm a Vikings fan. That's cool to get the Vikings team leaders. Very cool. Jim Turner. All right, we got three more to go. Three more packs to go, boys. Steve Largent, Hall of Fame receiver. This isn't one of the big boy packs that we want, or uh, cards from this pack that we want, but... Still a Hall of Fame receiver. Mike Bragg. Matt Robinson. Vince Ferragamo. John McDaniel. Pat Tilly. Doug Kotar. Harry Carson. Woo, Tony Green. Uh, Joe Delamuller. I have no idea how to say that guy's name, if you couldn't tell. Team leaders from the Colts and Woodrow Lowe. All right. Let's get this bad boy opened up. So far, only one of these packs, the gum wasn't stuck to the back of the card that was on the back. Luckily, they popped off fairly easily, though. Al Baker, Mike Webster, Ray Preston, Ron Johnson, Herman Weaver, Walter White, Carl Mock, Cleveland Elam, another checklist. That one's like perfectly centered. I know checklists are desirable sometimes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set that that guy aside until I know what it's worth. Cause that one's really well centered and obviously minty pack fresh. So we'll set that aside. We'll check that out later. Elsie Greenwood, Mike Dawson, Bruce Laird. We got one more pack to go. Man, I feel like we got the good one right off the bat, and it's just been kind of boring and dull since then. But, uh, whew, that was big, boys and girls, ladies. Terry Nelson, James Lofton. John Yarno, Dave Beverly, Luke Prestridge, Ricky Bell, Richard Bishop. That's a very happy looking guy. Look at that. He is happy. Bears team leaders. Hey, Walter Payton is on that one. We'll set that one aside. Pretty well centered, and Walter Payton's on it, so it's not 
the one we're looking for, but it's Walter Payton. Jack Thompson, Fred Cook, Archie Manning, and then Virgil Livers. We'll set that one aside. I don't know if the Archie Manning's worth anything. We'll, uh, we'll have to check it out. All right, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching me open up those packs of 1980 Topps football. Really appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch. Um, I know you could be doing millions of other things out there instead of watching some random guy open up packs of cards or show you PSA submission cards or whatever my videos might be. Um, I did mention in the video that I might be coming up with a thought to do with these 1980 pieces of gum. And I think uh, what I've decided I'm going to do is uh, since a thousand subscribers is a pretty big goal to meet uh, for trying to become monetized, what I'm going to do, I'm going to save these pieces of gum right here, these nasty pieces of gum. And I have five of them. There's four full ones and then one that kind of broke in half, but it's, it's there. In honor of me getting the Phil Sims rookie card, even though it's not going to be a PSA 10, and to help me maybe with a push towards 1,000 subscribers, 1,000 subscribers, what I'm going to do is for every 200 subscribers I get, I'm going to chew one of those pieces of bubblegum up. So when I get to 200 subscribers, I'm going to record a short video of me popping one of those in my mouth and chewing it up as a thank you for you guys for your support. And then uh, 400 600, 800, and 1,000. So perfectly worked out since I had five packs. So every 200 subscribers, that's what I'm going to do. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Please thumbs up. Please subscribe. And look out for future videos when I hit those subscriber numbers. Talk to you later. God bless. See you next time.